Okay, so we've turned our soap dispenser over, centered it on top of the chuck, and then secured it on the chuck, and we're ready to start trimming. And what we need for that are trimming tools like these. And the idea is that we're going to create a foot or a base for this pot to sit on. We'll be cutting down the surface area so that if it's sitting on something uneven, it won't wobble. It's important before you start trimming to know how much clay you have in the base of your pot. And we're going to start by trimming around the edge here. I'm going to take this tool and start carving away the edge of our base. Get larger chunks off with the tip here. And actually score into it like that. This clay is a little bit dry. I should have trimmed this an hour ago or so, but you can still see how that clay is coming off of there and not sticking to itself so that we can get a nice even trimming surface. Okay, so now I'm just going to define a foot. Like so. And then I'm going to move up and start working on the top surface. First thing I'm going to do is flatten it out so that we're starting with a flat surface. Like so. Next thing I'm going to do is take a trimming tool like this and carve away the inside. We have now formed a nice foot for the base of our soap dispenser. And we're just about done. In the next segment, I'm going to talk about some final thoughts and final things that you might want to do before you prepare it for the kiln and making sure that it's ready for the kiln. And we'll talk about that next.